morning boys today we are going to see relations and functions before that just a recap of what is a set so collection of well defined object is a set so this you have already studied in 9th standard so to extend the concept of set we are using the relations and function so to extend the concept of set we use relations and functions so you are very clear about a set and you have also studied ordered pairs so this is a ordered pair so x comma y is a ordered pair this you have studied in coordinate geometry now together with the set and the coordinate geometry we are going to solve relations and functions so set is denoted as curly bracket and coordinate you will use it as a ordered pair so this is ordered pairs so both set and coordinate we'll use it for the relations and functions so under the relation first we are going to start with cartesian product so to find out the cartesian product i'm going to take two non empty sets so let a and b be two non empty set then so if you are taking a and b as a two non empty set then the set of all the ordered pairs a and b that is a comma b such that small a belonging to capital a small b belonging to capital b so this is called the cartesian product of the set so this is written as a cross b is equal to a comma b such that a belongs to capital a small b belongs to capital b and here so the elements of a and the elements of b can be formed as the ordered pair so the first one so the first coordinate is said to be the elements of a and the second coordinate is said to be the elements of b so actually in a coordinate form the first element is said to be the ordinate and y value is said to be the abscissa and now so using this we are going to find out the cartesian product so for example let a is equal to 1 2 3 and b is equal to a comma b so find a cross b and b cross a so already you know how to find the product of a monomial and a binomial monomial and a monomial monomial with a trinomial so the same format we are going to use it for the cartesian product so first one a cross b 
so write the elements of a so 1 2 3 cross a comma b so the normal coordinate form so 1 a 1 b then 2 a 2 b and the last one again 3 a 3 b so shall we write it so 1 comma a 1 comma b 2 comma a 2 comma b 3 comma a and finally 3 comma b so the same thing we will follow for b cross a so a comma b cross 1 2 3 so the same thing a comma 1 a comma 2 a comma 3 then b comma 1 b comma 2 b comma 3 so the normal product i am doing for the monomial of the whole is the same method i am following here so when you are writing it you will write it with the coordinate so a comma 1 a comma 2 a comma 